Hey! Hey everyone, it's Lulu here and as you can see from the title of my video, yes, I am a student again. So if you saw my previous videos, you know that I quit my full-time job in consulting and to become a student, to become back to school, I am entering my PhD program in informatics. I've been adjusting. I just want to document my journey. So I'm so excited for this channel because and the new direction that I'm taking with it because I'm going to have fun these next five years documenting my PhD journey, all the conferences I'm going to go to, all the traveling I'm going to do. So I hope you guys are in the ride for it. I This channel is called Real with Lou for a reason. I'm going to show you the realness of everything, the realness of grad school, the realness of life, the realness of being a black woman in STEM, the realness of tech industry, everything. So stay tuned. Definitely um, click that notification bell for more videos. Subscribe to my channel so you can know when my next video drops. Okay, so we have a break in between these panel discussions. command line. Here's Lizzie. Terminal. My keys. What's up? Don't put me on camera. I'm speaking and shit, alright? <laughs> He's acting up for my channel. <laughs> <laughs> not really lunch but something to hold me over I had a meeting at one with my faculty advisor so that should be good and then after that I'll head over to the School of Nursing to work with my research team and and stuff like that so <laughs> Ooh, I got There's cookies and cream with Oreos and strawberries. I, I know it looks nasty, but I like it. It's so hot, y'all. So the most touching thing happened. Oh my gosh. Okay, so my current advisor from my PhD program, she went to, I guess, like a talk or something, and she got a book for me called Unapologetic Little Book. <laughs> called unapologetic why i can't speak unapologetically dope and it's titled lessons for black women and girls on surviving and thriving in the tech field and guess who wrote it my freshman computer science teacher i think it was comp sci one teacher and she was my freshman teacher at howard and she wrote it and she signed the book for me and they were talking about me and everything. And it's crazy how everything just comes full circle because like I was a horrible student at undergrad. Like I, I got a D in her class, like in freshman year. Uh, that was, we were learning C++, I got a D. And years later, I'm in a whole PhD program. So just to show you guys, like if you feel like you struggling your my gpa is off like i don't think i could do this don't count yourself out get that imposter syndrome out your head just keep going for what you want let them tell you no don't tell yourself no and yeah it was so touching so that's that's that
five o'clock now. I'm just getting in for the day in my room. So I'm very tired. I don't know if you can see from my eyes. <laughs> um, yeah, it's really hot outside and walking everywhere on campus. It gets tiring. Um, so I'm gonna eat dinner. I have still some work to do, so I'm gonna do some work. Then probably when the sun goes down, binge watch my show. Okay, so I'm watching Designated Survivor. I know I'm late. I'm only on season one. I'm almost finishing up season one. It is so good. If you watched Designated Survivor or you finished it, please comment below. Uh, or, I don't know, message me on Instagram or something or Twitter if you can talk about it. Because I definitely got a lot of opinions and a lot of stuff to say. But, um... Here you have it. I'm about to close out this video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.